Glory be to God in the highest. Welcome once again to the Success Nugget of Setumi, O Lord. My name is Afalabi Shamekoka from the King's Chamber and Vision of Setumi, O Lord. Today, I want to just ask a simple question and admonish you on the need to do away with worry. So why worry? An anonymous author made a statement, I'm too busy working on my own grass to notice if yours is greener. Worry does not empty tomorrow of its sorrow. It empties today of its strength, says Corey Ten Boom. Our lives are full of supposes. Suppose this should happen, or suppose that should happen. What could we do? How could we bear it? But if we are living in the tower of the dwelling place of God, all the supposes will drop out of our lives. We shall be quiet from the fear of evil, for no threatenings of evil can penetrate into the higher tower of God. When walking through the valley of the shadow of death, the psalmist could say, we will fear no evil. And if we are dwelling in God, we can say so too. So says Hannah Woodhull Smith. An anonymous author made a statement, and I quote, I am too busy working on my own grass to notice if yours is greener. So be patient. You may have to go through the worst to get the best in life. Never give up. Everyone has bad days. Pick yourself up and keep going. This is an anonymous author. Never quit. Bad days shouldn't be your last day. It teaches a lot about what to do and what not to. Silently observe when something hurts. Remember, you are not alone. Find a community of like-minded people to get support and be vocal on bad days. Chances are that there are more out there having the same kind of day. That can lead to opportunity in itself and new friendships. Listen to the story of an account of grass to grace. So many years ago, a young girl was born to a housemate and a coal miner. She definitely did not grow in the lap of luxury. Neither was she raised with a golden spoon. Living the life of poverty, where she used to wear dresses made out of potato sacks and was molested by relatives. Growing up, she didn't live in her situation mourning her today. She rose up from her state and pursued her future. Entered the world of media after getting the job of a newsreader in a local black radio station after she got her first talk show in Chicago. There was no looking back for this TV personality. Today, Oprah Winfrey is one of the most renowned TV personality who doesn't look like her past. Learn from this and move from whatever state you are to a greater state of glory. The grace of God is sufficient for you. God who takes delight in taking nobody to become somebody is the same yesterday, today and forever. It's your turn to be lifted. Only remain focused, take away the worries and what will be will be for God is forever faithful. Be blessed. My name is Afolabi Samekoka on plus 234-80333-74095. Subscribe to our channel on YouTube. Visit us on Instagram and other social media. And spread the news and God of all grace will bless you. We await your testimony because God is ever gracious. Take away worry, be anxious for nothing, and God will bless you. Stay blessed and stay tuned.